Eric Rudolph gets the big win tonight. The uh, only thing he didn't win was the dash, uh, led the final 86 laps. Well, tell me about uh, winning the Gerald Hills Memorial for the second year in a row. Uh, I can't explain it. I mean, the, win a prestigious event like this three times now in the last two. Uh, it's it's great. It's awesome. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, the track was a little bit different than it has been all year. Um, similar to how it was last year, actually. And, um, you know, kind of took a look back at our notes from last year. And, um, you know, as a team, it was a whole team effort. We had a really good car tonight. Tires were great. Um, couldn't ask for much more. Tell me about the race itself. At that long green flag period, kind of got caught up with traffic. I thought Tim Sears might be able to get you there. Did you? Uh, yeah, I knew someone was coming. I, I could tell that I was just Peter now. Just wasn't, just wasn't passing lap cars like I needed to. I was kind of just, just kind of there. Uh, I didn't really know what to do. I was struggling, and uh, in a lot of ways we got saved by a caution and uh, were able to regroup. Of course, later in the race, Justin Harris. Did you see him at all there towards the end? Because he looked pretty fast, about with 20 to 30 to go. Yeah, I seen him once. I seen him once, and then uh, after that, I didn't see him see him anymore uh, but it just seemed like it you know after those couple laps we're able to uh, you know maybe put a gap on him after that did those cautions there at the end hurt you a little bit uh, mentally maybe I mean okay. there's a lot of cautions it just seemed like I was just waiting for another one at the end there last I don't know five six laps or so uh, it seemed like for a while there we just couldn't get going just couldn't you know, it seemed like every other lap was a caution. And, sure did. Uh, <laughs> some guys were running out of gas, uh, concerned really? about weight at the end of the race, just, you know, because I knew the tires would burn off and, mm -hmm. you know, the, uh, the the fuel mileage and such. But uh, got a little momentum, momentum going as a team right now, and we got a lot of bigger races coming up, so uh, we're excited about it. And, uh, you know, we got a good car and we got a good baseline, so uh, as a team, we'll. Uh, move forward. Were you okay on the scales? Uh, was there still a lot to spare? Oh, the, yeah, we, we, were, we were comfortable. Yeah. Okay, all right, so well, you, cause I'm, I, I can only imagine what that must feel like coming up in that scale going, geez, did, did we make it or not? Yeah, I mean, you know, that's always in the back of your mind, but uh, we, we're always, we always play it a little bit safe. And obviously, the, with the win and the extra money, exactly what you need at this time of year, I would think. Uh, you know, any time of year, it's good. Uh, I can think of the big races and all that stuff, you know? Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah, any, any, any time you can you know, have a night like tonight, uh, it just makes, makes you appreciate, uh, you know, the hard work mm -hmm. and uh, when things aren't going your way, uh, you look forward to things like this. Come back later in the week, we'll have one after his heat. Congratulations, Eric. Good to see you as always. I appreciate you sticking around for me. Thank you. Yeah, no problem.